So the 1930s Depression Era kitchen is one of my favorites because it reminds me of when I was growing up and my grandmother canning and things like that. And I think a lot of other people relate to it as well. One of my favorite things in this kitchen is the ironing board. So Elmer Shoemaker made this. He made it in his garage with a bunch of others. And then to make extra money, he and his family would go out into the country and sell the ironing boards during the Great Depression. It's an example of doing what you have to do to keep your family going, and I think everyone can relate to that. An object in here that might be missed is this little box on top of the cupboard. It doesn't look like much, but what it actually is is a homemade radio. Can you imagine having just a simple homemade radio to get your news and what's going on in the world? So the woman in the kitchen is using a butter churn to turn cream into butter, a very common thing that no one does anymore. And the wooden box in front of that is actually a butter mold. So you pack the butter in there while it's still soft, let it cool, and you would have a one pound block of butter. Come visit our exhibit at the Kentucky Historical Society and like and follow for more.